Hi, my name's Simon from Motordrome. Now today we're going to take a walk around and a drive off this uh, absolutely gorgeous 1966 uh, Morris Traveller that you can see lurking behind me here. Um, two videos, one walk around, one driving, plus a bit of engine starting and idling action at the end of both of them. Hope you like them. Okay, let's take this uh, beautifully restored 1966 Morris Traveller, or Morris Minor 1000 Traveller, to give it its full title for a spin. Don't know why they call them 1000s when it's got an 1100cc engine, but uh, there you go. Oh, it's really warm in here, actually. Um, right, all light ignition light come up as they should. Starts really nice and it's got a beautiful sounding engine on it, really sort of. Uh, really like a sewing machine. This one's also got uh, aftermarket temperature gauge and oil pressure gauge and they're both showing as they should, no signs of any misfiring, hesitancy or overheating. So let's take it for a run. Odometer is showing 26,000, it's just that as you just turn around 25 but we'll round it up one for the sake of argument. I'd love to say that's genuine but we don't have enough history to confirm that. Um, it may be, it may not. Whilst we haven't got all the history back to day one, we have got uh, a massive amount of bills for its restoration. Ooh, it's got servo brakes on this one as well, which uh, make them slightly sharper than I'm used to on mine. But, um, as I say, drives absolutely superbly. It's nice to see one with the uh, sprung steering wheel as well. It's got the uh, period correct narrow tyres on it. Previous owner um, resisted the temptation to fit wider uh, wider tyres to it. And we're just poodling along now at uh, 40, just over 40 miles an hour and it's driving beautifully, rides nicely, no funny suspension noises. Gearbox is nice, there's no uh, crunching in, in uh, synchros, obviously there's no synchro on first gear in this. Temperature gauge is sitting at just below the, uh, the halfway point.
think there we have it. It's it's superb, it really is. Um, looks superb, drives superbly. Just a really, really lovely miner. My name's Simon. You can reach me in the office on 0118 907 1495. Or you can go to our website, which is www.moto-drome.com for any more info. Okay, quick video of starting and idling on this uh, 1966 Morris Traveller. Ignition on. You can see ignition light and oil light come up as they should. Starts beautifully. I've just done 10 miles on it. Um, idles really nicely. As you can see, temperature gauge and oil pressure gauge working as they should. And the fuel gauge. And now we'll show a bit on the bonnet. Okay, minor engine. Engine's up, actually sounds lovely. You can probably hear a sort of diesel noise in the background, that's just when you're next to the train station, the train just about to fill out. But um, the engine itself on this minor is superb. Um, if you look at the inner wings here, you think they're discoloured. Yes, they are, but it's dinner troll, it's not rust. The old white underneath that, it's the previous owner. So we didn't want the, uh, the wings to rust anymore, which the rust once we've replaced them. So they've all been dinner troll. As you can see, the, um, the engine is lovely on it. It's got all the right um, stickers and transfers on it and stuff. It's just a super little car, it really is.